Alright, hello. In this video today I'm going to be showing you how to set up uh, Doom so that you can start speedrunning. So, uh, speedrun.com rules uh, say that uh, they recommend Crispy Doom or PR Boom. I personally use Crispy Doom because I like it more. And Crispy Doom can be downloaded from this location. Link will be in the description. Once you download this file, it'll be in your downloads. It's a .zip, so uh, when you extract it, all the files will be in a folder. And when you open the folder, you'll see a bunch of stuff uh, like the application Crispy Doom and Crispy Doom Setup. If you open Crispy Doom, it's just normal Doom, Ultra Violence, which is the uh, category, which is the uh, difficulty that the category is run on. And so, yeah, it's just normal Doom. So, <clears throat> after you've downloaded everything and made sure it works and your controls are to your liking, you can go to the uh, Windows command line by either going to this file path and typing CND, uh, CMD or right clicking on the Windows icon and opening command prompt. Either way, um, you'll want to type in CD get the path of the folder, paste it in here, and then press enter. Once you're in the file directory of the application, you can type in what's on this uh, screen right here. The name of the application, crispy-doom, dash record the name of the demo file that you wanna record, for this one, it'll be test uh, run and dash skill four dash comp level three. These are just dash skill four puts it onto the ultra violence difficulty by default and dash comp level three emulates the engine from back in the 90s so that it's considered a legitimate run. Once you press enter, the game will start up right away and you can complete a run I'll just do a com quick run right here. Ah, that could have been a PB. Whatever. Uh, and once you finish your run, you can close out of the application. And as you can see here, it uh, said demo test run LMP was recorded. So once you have your uh, lump file, which in my case saved right here, um, you can go back to the command window and type, retype in the name of the application. Dash play demo, and then the name of the run. <clears throat> and after that, the application will start back up, but it's just playing back exactly what you did. So yeah, that's about it. This can be used for individual level runs or full game runs. And of course, you're going to have to have your own uh, demo file, uh, your own Doom WAD file. Uh, I don't think I can legally provide one, so you'll have to find your own online. But other than that, that's about it. Thank you for watching.